Let's begin the hour in South Africa, where a teenager has been killed by a stray bullet as rioting and looting continues. The incident happened in Vosluras Township in Hauteng. Protests triggered by the jailing of former President Jacob Zuma have widened into unrest over the continued hardships and inequalities in South Africa. At least 72 people have been killed in the unrest. Authorities plan to deploy up to 25,000 troops in Hauteng and KwaZulu-Natal provinces where security forces have been struggling to quell the violence. There are now concerns about food and fuel shortages arising from that unrest. Meanwhile, the acting minister in the presidency has appealed for calm. We urge members of the public to remain calm and exercise restraint during these trying times. Government is working with the National Consumer Goods Council to ensure food security. If we have members of the public flocking into the shops and malls to buy foodstuff, we are also risking the spread of COVID-19 and it will go to uncontrollable, uncontrollable levels with the Delta variant that is currently prevalent in our country. Another area of concern that has been brought into the attention of government is members of the community taking up arms to try and protect their, com uh, their properties. We understand the concern for community for their safety and the, their need to protect their properties. We would like to urge these communities to work with the law enforcement agencies to stop the looting and violence and to operate within the rule of law.